floodlights are shining down on the players here at the home of Manchester City. My name is Derek Ray, and ready with his tactics board to provide all the analysis is Stuart Robson. And we've got so much to look forward to. This is where it all begins in Europe's Premier Club competition, the UEFA Champions League, the group stage, match day one action. It is Manchester City facing FC Copenhagen. Thanks, Derek. Well, the hosts are clear favourites going into this tie. But with that comes pressure, particularly against a team that will remain compact, are well drilled defensively and are a threat on the counter-attack. If the hosts don't go through, though, it will be a major upset. Manchester City lineup. Ederson stands between the posts. Joao Cancelo starts with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Kevin De Bruyne plays alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And the main threat in attack today should be Erling Haaland. Have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. Well, they're starting in a very solid 4 5 1, but they transition really quickly, and key to that are the wide players. They'll support the centre forward as soon as they win the ball back, and they usually do it with a lot of quality. It's the opening match day, Champions League group stage, match day one, underway. Christiansen, Victor Klaasson, Andreas Cornelius, but he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. Holland. Given away by City. Zeka. Well, we have to say, Stuart, respect and admiration grows for Kevin De Bruyne with each passing year. So many attributes. What are you looking for from him in this game? Well, he's such a natural finisher. He has everything a good goal scorer needs. Composure, technique and awareness. He will certainly need to be tightly marked today. Spot on with that tackle. Falk. De Bruyne. Well, very effective play in possession. Could be! Oh, that is a superb save. Now, how about the short corner? No problems grabbing hold of that one. Kevin Dix. Cornelius has it. Dix with it. We're getting the ball forward. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. A City free kick forthcoming.
Rashon. Darani. This attack looks highly promising. Might go ahead. And the post gets in the way. Not to be. He's got the right idea with that pass. And the ball is loose. And a goal! 1-0 it is. They've been pushing for the opener. And now they have it. Well, here you can see what a good goal this is. He hits it so cleanly and the keeper has no chance. That's a great strike. So City get things going again, and the onus is on them to erase the damage done by that concession. Holland, and the emphasis is on creativity. But quick thinking defensively. Out of play, City throw. It needs an accurate cross. Timely intervention. Victor Klasson. Rasmus Falk Jensen on the ball. Just cutting off the supply. The pressure was high and they could be in here. He must finish. Oh, wonderful save. Well, he reacts so quickly there. That's a great save. Who can he pick out? And did his job defensively. Victor Klasson. Cutting in, what can he do from this position? It's got to be! He scored once already, and close to making it a double. Well, every time he gets on the ball, he looks a real danger today. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Insufficient accuracy as regards the corner. Kevin Dix. And blocked for now. Can he put it away? And a goal to increase their advantage. It's a two-goal lead now. Well, let's have another look because this is a goal they have thoroughly deserved. They've played really well so far. So back underway with the scoreline standing at 2-0. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. De Bruyne. Now with Silva. Really effective shielding under pressure. It did look on for them, but not to be. Well, as you can see, the visitors have had most of the ball. And that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly. Their pressing has been excellent. And they just haven't stopped working. It's been a fantastic performance up to now. Indeed, perhaps they can cash in again. Let's see. 
Not a great challenge. Free kick here. towards that far post well it's actually ended up being easy meat for the keeper Holland Phil Foden now the attack continues they're making considerable progress well he's given it away De Bruyne the supporters want to see him have a go in the centre Holland and now Rodri can he take advantage able to clear the danger at least for now Andreas Cornelius what about the stoppage time situation two minutes the word goalkeeper getting in the way superb save well, could this be the turning point? The fans are certainly hoping so. Over it comes. Oh, cleared off the line. Alert defending. Marvellous anticipation. And so the half-time whistle is sounded here in Manchester. Well, we don't often say this, but I think it's fair on this occasion. A muted performance from Phil Foden, Stuart. Well, Derek, he has to impose himself on this game. He's been far too quiet so far. If they are to get back into this, he needs to make something happen and start getting some shots away. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Foden. Nicely cut out. Holland! And a fine stop to turn the ball away. A city corner it is. Well, as you can see, it wasn't even close, was it? No debate about that one. He's driven in the corner. It might still be problematic. Foden. On to Holland. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Victor Klasson. Mohamed Darani. And the emphasis is on creativity. I have to say he's done really well here he's in the right place and then a decent finish that's a good goal well it has been one-sided but they deserve the plaudits for the fact that they've kept going and going Foden. This is looking threatening. Holland. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Kocholava. And very deftly cut out. This might be ideal for the counter.
Holland. Now with De Bruyne. Holland. A goal. He's dispatched it. Much to the sheer delight of the fans. Well, as the replay shows us, Kevin De Bruyne picks out the pass to beat that defensive line. And Haaland made the finish look easy, as he so often does. It's a lovely goal. So they get the ball moving again. 3-1 the scoreline here. What's going to happen next? Falk. What can they do from here? Well, disappointing end to the move. Bernardo Silva. Gundogan. And now Rodri. Bernardo Silva. Crossing possibilities. Not what he was intending. Bad pass. Now just the tackle that was needed. Could be a chance to break here. Will it be sufficiently imaginative? Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. Retaining possession proving difficult. Well, attacking possibilities. Foden. Oh, he saved it well. A change in the offing for City. It's a short one. De Bruyne. Rodri! And that goes down as a very disappointing attempt. Well, the keeper can't believe his luck. That's a really poor effort. Corner awarded. <laughs> And Manchester City will go to their bench. Let's see about the delivery. Terrific block. Another corner conceded. What can they do with this one? Short option preferred. The inside route looking promising. Oh, great defending. Grealish. Phil Foden now. Beautifully disguised ball. That's all they can conjure for now. Just ten minutes remaining here. Well, oh, that pass easy on the eye. And Bernardo Silva has it. In it goes! It looked as though they were down and out. Not a bit of it. What will happen next? Well, here it is again, and it's really poor defending. They just don't show enough urgency to get tight or make a block, which is why the ball has ended up in the back of their net.
Well, back underway, and a glut of goals here. 3 2. Five minutes remaining, and one thing is certain no one is leaving because it's still close. Might be onto something with that ball. Who can he pick out? And taken away, he won the ball. Well, if City score now, these fans will go absolutely wild. What a finish we've got here. It's got to be! Goalkeeper getting in the way, superb save. Kevin De Bruyne with the corner. Grealish. Oh, a goal! What a comeback! Who on earth could have predicted this? Well, when you see this again, the defending just isn't good enough. The clearance doesn't get enough height on it, doesn't get enough distance on it, and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area and they don't reorganise themselves, and that's why the ball's in the back of their net. Not many sides would have the mental strength to bounce back from adversity like this team. Kevin Dix. Falk. Can they push ahead on the closing stages? And there's the whistle. They cannot be separated after 90 minutes.